every single album will always be a reflection of who we all are, but you know, who we are continually changes from album to album and from day to day, of course. So, si, senor. It won't be a reflection of how we are necessarily today, but in general, who we are, just people, yes. I mean, it's not going to be like a different band, but I definitely feel like uh, you're going to hear our next record and you're going to be like, that sounds like Cheers Elephant. But you're not going to be like, oh, that sounds like that song or that song they already wrote. Um, so, for example, we got some, uh, some definitely some like lower BPM grooves coming up, beats per minute for the layman's term. Yeah, slowing it down a bit, but not losing the energy. And we got this kind of like, some of the songs have this sort of, mm, how do you describe it? Flow. 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 Not from progressive, but like our own type of flow. Yeah, like a little touching on a little bit of funk, a little African. Um, but yeah, pretty eclectic on the whole. But uh, yeah, I'm, I'm really excited to go back into the studio because we're kind of, we cut all the ones that we kind of play live now. And then uh, we're definitely experimenting with a whole genre of new sounds and samples and all that. So uh, it's definitely going to be different in that sense. It's wonderful, actually. It, it's exactly what the four of us needed, moving from Philadelphia to California. I mean, we still got some sun there, but, you know, it's the East Coast sun versus the West Coast sun, which is all the time with no, not a cloud in the sky. No humidity really seals the deal. That's definitely um, very good. And uh, we, we surf now, so. We always knew that we wanted to not live in one place our entire lives. And... Um, we all had different like dreams of where we would want to live. Like we all like hiking and camping and just, and so with like our influences of what we really want to do and some of our friends, our manager um, ended up working for red light management out of Los Angeles. Uh, and so it just made sense to kind of focus our attention to Southern California around that point. Um, and we have not looked back since. All, fence All are elephants good. are relevant. I've met about four. One painted a picture for me. I did not. My friend met him. He was over in Thailand. <laughs> <Does he> out? <laughs> but he brought me back the picture that he painted. Oh, I do remember that. Yeah. I've Thailand. probably met, I don't know, a handful. So... It's all based on the first elephant to come over to America from India um, and cross the ocean. And on the boat ride there, they ran out of water. So all they had left were barrels of ale to give to the elephant. So they just fed that to the elephant and it refused to drink anything else from that point on. So the captain of the ship took it to Coney Island to turn into a sideshow to where you would pay a nickel and watch the elephant on cork a bottle of beer and put it back. Hence, cheers, elephant. I have nice hair. Really that's nice. probably my best compliment. Yeah, that's a pretty good compliment. Um, a lot of people like your hair and your drumming. And um, you want to compliment a songwriter? Compliment his lyrics. It means you like listen to his song. So I'm gonna go with that one. Listen to his words. <laughs> Voice of a generation. Let me think. Faces melted or blown? Melted. I like blown. Faces blown off. And then melted. And then yes. <laughs> Babe, you're watching Babel and we're Cheers Elephant. <laughs> <laughs>